Hey Sagittarius, welcome back to the channel. How are you? Hope you're having a great day. Whew. Sure is getting hot out there. Make sure you're well, de well hydrated and don't get dehydrated. Um, and uh, Sagittarius, welcome. Let's go ahead and get your reading started. I really appreciate your subscription. Hit that bell for notification. And uh, thank you so much for all your likes. Let's get your reading started. Sagittarius, what kind of energy are you in? Spirit, let's get some energy and vibes from Sag. What do we got here? Got the Emperor. Judgment. Mmm, Ten of Pentacles. The world. Okay. So, Sag, you got, you got the Emperor reversed. Okay. And we got judgment. Okay, judgment. Kind of get the... Your energies are giving out... There's definitely gain here. Gain. Definitely gain with the Ten of Pentacles. And the world card. Change, change, change is coming. So I feel like there's, there's compassion and you built up a lot of credit. You built, you're such a wonderful person. You built up a lot of credit with the realm up above and below. There's obstruction, and I'll tell you why there's obstruction with the, with the emperor upside down, okay? Because, well, I'll just be straight up, Satch. You look good doing it, and a lot of people see you, and they want to judge you. Okay, so you feel judgment and there's a change of, there's a change with the judgment card. The judgment card is about change and, and, and renewal and outcome. You're going through a definite transformation. I mean, so the, the obstacle part with the reversed emperor is that with all these changes that are that are you feeling right now that your energy is giving out you're gonna have success this is the right before success there's always um, there's always movement there's always flight Phew. so you might be in the cusp of, of a big, amazing Ten of Pentacles, okay? So, um, I know it feels like judgment, judgment, but there's a lot of good heading your way in the next few, I mean, this is like family, good stuff, Build, you're building a legacy for yourself. Um, you're, you, the investments that you've been making in yourself. The, I mean, you're thinking about, you're really thinking about your retirement. I mean, retirement as in, you know, in the near future, you're, gonna, you're doing stuff now to look out for yourself for the future. And so happy and positive. Ten of Pentacles. I mean, that's pretty amazing. Your energy is glowing right now. This is so good. And, you know, you might be feeling, um, you might be feeling that all of these, oh, when this stuff kind of happens, when you, when you take flight, you, it's, it's scary. Can you imagine like being an astronaut and going uh, to outer space for the first time, you're going to feel scared a little bit, you know, and, but I want you to know 
that with this world card here, what it is is this is your uh, this is the energy. See this? See that? See that? All all on the corner. You see you all over here. These these are the powerful energies that that are are on your side. The eagle, your angels. See the eagle and the angel, and you got the lion energy, and you got the bull energy. So this all of this is all of the spirits and 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 spirit animals your your spirit animals inside you are are guiding you and helping you at the moment you're going to feel you're going to feel energy okay that's awesome which is you're you're exactly where you need to be okay i'm going to go ahead and uh, Pull some cards for the the positive and negative energies around you, and kind of give you a heads up on on what's what the energies around you are are saying at the moment. Spirit, what kind of energies is around such to be warned about? Okay, this one wants to come out. Let's go this way. Okay. Ace of Cups, Six of Pentacles, we got the Sun card. Ho oh, oh. <laughs> ho, that's happy. Temperance, okay. So, there is a, uh, so you got, you know, when, 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 when you are doing absolutely amazing, you know, look like a million, million bucks, um, the energies around you tend to not want to give what, what their 100% intention because, because they see you and they're like, hey, you know what, uh, Sag has got it going on. So, so just, Keep that in mind, because the one energy around you is the Six of Pentacles. And so somebody who gives a lot might refrain from giving, okay? So I got this energy around you that somebody is, um, is, is, is not willing to give as much to you as they normally do, okay? So you got that energy around you. And you got the Ace of Cups. The Ace of Cups is an awesome card to, to, to get in a reading. I mean, uh, it's about abundance. Uh, it's about love, attraction, and things that make you smile. Because, um, because this is the time that you need to open your heart. You need to open your heart. And... Once you open your heart, you open your eyes, you know, and you get to see. Um, there's going to be a lot of good. This is the, see, you got the Ace of, Ace of uh, Cups here, and you're going to be crying. I'm serious. You're going to be crying because there's going to be some happy, happy, good things that's, that's just about to happen here. Okay? And you got the Sun card. The sun is all about happiness, enlightenment, union, and um, commitment to yourself, self, self-love. And um, see this, see this, see this kid, uh, the childish child on a horse. See that? That's just amazing. You know, that's Sag. That's you, and the sun is shining on you. You know, and um, you got the Temperance card of hope. And the temperance card is, is basically an angel that is basically transferring uh, your, your tears of joy. I mean, tears of sadness to tears of joy. You know, you got the temperance card. And um, 
this has to do with your economy, your money, and your, um, it, it's about how uh, you are gonna get smart and, and uh, manage things better, and uh, you're gonna have better accommodations coming up, you know, you change that. Um, it's about uh, it's about moderation. You 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 put you get yourself together in a place with the help of you're going to be more tempered with your money, with your attitude, and I got to tell you, I got to share this with you, Satch. Okay, now we go through our day. And there's a lot that we see, but we don't pay attention to it. You know what I mean? And I'll tell you why, okay? So I'm gonna tell you something that you were not aware of before this moment, okay? Okay, it's a story about brown shoes, okay? So I'll give you $20 if you show me brown shoes. Every time you see brown shoes, I'll give you $20. Let's pretend, okay? So now, you're like, Tony, you're like, Tony, there's brown shoes across the street. Give me my money. So your eyes are open to it from now on, okay? You didn't care about brown shoes five minutes ago, but now it, it means something to you because there's something that you're gonna get by seeing brown shoes. So there's a lot of things like that that you see every day that could earn you money or benefit you but you don't see it. So you need to uh, investigate in your life, what is your brown shoes? It could be a physical thing, or it could be something that you need to learn as far as skills go, you know what I mean? So that's what you're gonna get with the temperance here, okay? So the energies around you, your angels are, are helping you with temperance. And you got the sun, you got the sun, you got good energy coming up. I mean, like it's like somebody opening up the blinds and the sunlight's coming in and you're a plant. You know, you're like, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> it's gonna be really good. Ace of Cups, good energy, good energy. It's just that this one, you know? So this one is like, this one is like, when, 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 you're gonna get this, Sag. This is always gonna be a part of your life. You're gonna get people who give normally, but sometimes they give less because, uh, and, 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 and also like, it's also maybe spirit saying in a way that right now is, is your time to give, okay? Right now, if you didn't give before, you should give now, okay? Don't be stingy with your money right now. Yeah, make money, keep some for yourself because wealth is about keeping. Wealth is about accumulating, okay? And um, it's good to give. You have to give some, but remember, keep some for yourself. Pay yourself first, okay? Pay yourself, make sure you're good and um, and you might want to refrain um, from, you know, from right now, there's about your, uh, pe uh, with the Six of Pentacles, um, you, that the energies around you is going to feel like that, okay? So, I'm going to go ahead and, and pull some cards for you. Uh, clarification and outcome and some let's see what's gonna what's gonna happen in a few with all of these energies around you and the way you're feeling okay and uh, I don't know what to tell you I mean the next card that I'm gonna pull it's gonna be good because your energy is absolutely amazing the energies around you are all positive okay all positive and let's see what the outcome
got the magician. Magician. We got the four of swords. Four of swords. We'll pull one more here. Two more came out at the same time. Let's go ahead and grab those. Okay. All right. So with the magician card, the magician is it's about your skill. It's about manifesting, you know, and um, it's about diplomacy. It's about um, it's about feeling. It's about creating. Your will, okay. Your will, your your will to manifest, magician, you know, and um, and so see, he has the the magician is is all about. See, everything is on the table: the sword, the wand, the cup. So it's saying that, and, and pentacles is on that table as well. And it's saying that with all of the stuff that you have in your life, the things that you didn't do, use before, utilize. Because see, like everything on earth has already been here. We human beings have taken things that's already been here and put it together and made things out of it. The wood, the God made the trees, we make a house out of it. Um, the, the, earth, the dirt has... The, all of the uh, uh, iron and gold and silver and all this stuff, and then we make stuff out of it, right? So we don't want to create nothing. We just redesign whatever's already on earth and make something new out of it, you know what I mean? So you need to do some um, alchemic changes in your life, you know? One of the things I wanted to tell you is you know what? Get advice. You know, get a get a counsel from your church. You know, or or from one of your elders or somebody you really respect, and you won't believe it. It'll change a lot of views that you have that uh, that you didn't know about. You know what I mean? And uh, okay, so we got the lovers. All right, the lovers card, and the lovers card is about attraction, beauty. And, 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 it's, and it's about triumphant over overcoming obstacles, okay? And it's it's a, a man and a woman with uh, with a heavenly presence guiding uh, two people together. It's a very happy card uh, when it's when it's the right side way, okay? So you got so in, <laughs> this is amazing, right? and but you got the. Your judgment on on certain things might be off, okay? Um, your tongue. Did, you know what? In the next couple of days, I really want you to watch out what you're saying, okay? Um, there's some YouTube videos on um, how to use your... See, I was watching uh, Elvis Presley, and one of the things everybody loved Elvis for was his charisma. He lit up a room like... There's nobody's business. Everybody loved him. And there's some YouTube videos on charisma and how to develop it and use it. And if you never never used your charisma, you need to go and watch those videos because believe it or not, 95% of the people that, um, that are successful use charisma as one of their tools. And, and this card, when the Queen of Swords is upside down, it's telling me uh, to tell you that go and investigate your charisma. Your charisma needs to be uh, uh, employed in your life, you know. And um, go ahead and check that out, okay? And you're gonna things are gonna be awesome for you. You're gonna be telling more jokes. More people are gonna love you. And and Sag, you really need to use your charisma because because. As a philosopher, you might, 
you know, talk about things that people don't understand. Because, and when you add your char uh, charismatic uh, uh, self to it, then it opens people up more to uh, receive the wonderful things that you trying to tell them. You know, it's all about uh, the way you speak. And you have the four of swords for your for the outcome with all of this energy and this is telling you to uh, it's telling you to get up see this person's laying down but you got it reversed so what what's what what your what the outcome is it, energy is telling me is that you got to start moving you got to start you got to start doing those things that will will keep the wheel turning you know you don't want to get your wagon stuck in the mud you it's got to keep it spinning okay you got to get up you got to rise from your slumber this is it okay and uh do it easily though don't like don't like jump up and hit the ceiling or and your head's gonna hurt okay but you do need to keep get things going. You need to invest in your in your stuff. And finally, you got the Queen of Pentacles, and the Queen of Pentacles is a is a very good card of hope. And and uh, what this is, it's 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 about health. It's about your body. It's about caring for yourself, mental care. Um, it's about here and now, what's happening around you. Pay attention to what's happening around you. Um, don't dwell in the past. You know, focus on what's going on around you. Fix yourself. And um, remember, if you help yourself first to become a, a, an amazing, uh, amazing queen or king, then you will be able to help other people very easily um, and you need to you need to think about take some time to think about yourself first then you then you could help others okay at the moment you got some major stuff happening you got manifest you're manifesting um, when you manifest love comes running in okay and uh, you know, you, you you might be quick to to say things, or you might uh, uh, have been saying things, you know, a little too easy, too much, um, like a sharp tongue is what I'm saying that cuts. Sagittarius, you bold, you talk like you see something, you're with your mouth and you could cut an apple, you know, like that apple's in two pieces, <laughs> you know? And um, so you gotta kind of keep an eye, keep, keep, a, keep a watch on that because your judgment could be off a little bit. Um, so, and then, but I do want you to go ahead and uh, pick yourself up and get moving, get the wheels turning. And remember, it's your health. Focus on your health. Uh, Sagittarius, you have you have a kind of like a personality where uh, you could easily get addicted to things, you know. And I know that um, you got a really good, strong shoulder uh, on, on on things, but however, you know, you could start drinking a lot or 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 any other stuff. So if you really need help to um, to drink less or if you have other addictive things that you're addicted to go to your uh, local herb store and get some kava kava it's a herb and uh, take it and see how you feel it's known throughout history to uh, to help with addictions um, and being a philosopher and an alchemist it's one of the things that you should definitely have on your uh, herb shelf um, for your healing. 
And um, so I just wanted to put that out there to you. Let's go ahead and uh, get some cards for um, basically advice from the spirit and the double bonds. Let's see what's going on, okay? All right, I'm gonna pull one card from here. Oh, look at this, this one wants to come out. Journey, got the, got the Knight of Wands here, okay? And this is a very happy card, good card. I mean, I'd be playing, like, if I was to play piano to this, I'd be playing some really good, happy tune. It's about um, purpose. Yes, go for it, is your advice from the old dons and spirit. And it's about projects. It's about movement, moving forward. Um, it's about passion. You're gonna, your passion is gonna, it's gonna, it's coming back. I know we Sagittarius have been in the slump for a while. I say this all the time, but um, you're free spirited, Sag. You're a horse with a, and you're ready to aim. Your arrow, you know. Uh, you're free spirited. You gotta remember, feel like a, feel like a, like that, you know. Um, and let me go ahead and pull an advice from the old Don. What do we got here? What's this? Oh, this one must be. Manifestation will happen. What's this? What's this one? Nice. Okay. So you're. I'm getting advice here, really, really quick. Um, spirit, well, the, basically the Dons are saying that, you know, somebody was skimming off the top and you feel there was a backstabber, but you know what? They're telling you that this, this is red, okay? This is what, this is what makes you feel bad, okay? Now, real friends share the same enemy. Try to find those friends that, that, are, that, are, that are going to raise you, raise up your spirit, you know? Um, share your, your good times and bad times. You can't share your good times with friends all the time. You gotta share your bad times too. And those real friends share the same enemies because when you, when you tell them that, hey, I'm having a bad time with this, ah, I'm dealing with this, they're going to say, I'm dealing with it too. Those are your real friends, okay? Not the friends that you have to say good things to all the time and then they relate to good things. But also, one of the, one, another good thing is, like I said, you know, your, your, your mouth, you know, you got a sharp tongue, Sag. So stop talking too much, sharp stuff then manifestation will come true, okay? This is the key. This is the key that you've been waiting for, okay? I'm giving you a key. Okay. Sag, that's what I got for you. Thank you so much for hitting that bell. Subscribe. Please subscribe. I need my subscriptions to go up, and you're the person that's going to help me today to do that. I wish you all the best, Sag. Thank you so much for your likes. Have a great one, and I'll be doing this in just a few again, so I'll see you then.